good to be with you again. It's been a, a few weeks since we've updated you with what's going on, but I'd like to share with you three areas today. One is the update on the school. Uh, still, School is still closed because of COVID-19, as you probably know. Uh, maybe in Canada and U.S. our schools are open up, but in Uganda they haven't made that uh, step yet. So our schools are still closed, but we're still providing food at the end of the month. We, uh, the children come, uh, but there's about 50 staying at our school, but the rest of the children come and we give them a sack of food to take home for the month. And we're still paying our staff. We just felt that, um, you know, if we don't pay our staff, we will lose them and it'd be hard to find good Christian teachers again. So we are paying our staff. It doesn't cost us that much to do that. So again, uh, support for that is appreciated. Uh, the other big thing is our children's home. Uh, we are now have got all the windows and doors installed and we have just now completed all the plastering on the outside of the building. It's looking really good. Our next step would be to paint the outside. So we're trying to raise some money for that. And then after we get the outside painted, uh, of course we want to do that because we have the scaffolding up. And once we get the outside painted, we will focus in on the interior uh, where we'll plaster the inside, put the electrical in as well as the plumbing. So it's coming along and again, we appreciate support for that. And the big thing that uh, is happened in the last month is we've you know, been concerned about the, the hunger that is happening in, uh, especially around our school in the Laurel area. So we put out a plea uh, for help and we call it Feed the Hungry. And I'm so thankful for the support that we have received. In fact, money is still coming in. Right now, we have been able to provide food for over 850 homes. That's over 2,000 people. And that will increase uh, this next week when we give out more food uh, because of your donations. So I wanna thank you uh, for your su uh, support. Uh, without you, we couldn't do what we're doing in Uganda and Guatemala. So God bless for your faithfulness in prayer and support.